trash and get a tire ready. So I noticed you got a little nationwide series tag. Is did you get this off of like some kind of raffle? eBay, eBay, eBay. Now, eBay? It's been a long time, but I, I tried to NASCAR race when I was younger. I'm grown up and realized that dirt racing is what I need to be doing. What made you want to go to it? Well, we were actually at East Bay and. Uh, Schrader was a little late for hot laps, and me and Schrader's nephew, Joey Walsh, are really good friends. And uh, we were just there, and he, I fit Schrader's tire suit, and that's how it all started. But the problem over here is you got to buy like a $40,000 Longhorn or something. Well, I mean, what do you got? You got the old, old Longhorn or no, something? That's, that's how we're managing to do this. I built every piece of it. My car owner is an old chassis manufacturer from way back in the day, Billy Hess. And I'm a fabricator by trade growing up in Mooresville, so... We decided we were going to build our own car and come see if we could stack up against the guys. This is chassis number 001. This is the first one off the jig. We like to think that we know how to make the front end steer. And dirt racing has predominantly been steering the car with the back of the car for many years. So we've tried to take some of our dirt or our pavement knowledge in the front end spindles and geometries and all that stuff through migration and just seeing if we can make something different. You know, everybody's out here racing the same car, so if you got something different, you have a chance of beating the other guys.
What tire did that come off of? That was my right front. Huh. That's well, it's not I, wearing even. Can't get nothing past you. <laughs> no, what do you I, mean? I better go to the chassis builder and tell me he needs to work on the setup a little more. What do you mean? I'm just, that's what it is, right? I'm kidding. No, but you want it to wear even. That's when you know yeah. you got the patch of the tire. I got a little too much camber in it for sure. Traditionally, you want to have full tire contact, right? right that's the right. idea, right? Yep. But we're still in the building it ourselves trial and error stuff, you know? Like, it's not like it's running bad. No. You're out running really good cars. We're, we're, we're making progress. That's, that's all I can keep asking. It's a little bit better every time we play with it. So far, we're getting a little bit better every time we get 